We're all getting older, right? And we would love a sneak peek into the future to know how quickly we are going to age. But what if we told you that your grip, your grip could actually provide some insight? Having a strong grip isn't just important for getting the lid off a stubborn jar. Grip strength can also provide crucial details about your health. The people who have better grip strength, their aging is a lot slower. You know, we call it sort of immunosenescence. Your immune system also benefits from having good grip strength. So your ability to bounce back from disease, any type of disease. We saw this in COVID a lot. And the third would be prevention of frailty. Dr. Ardashir Hajmi with Cleveland Clinic says weak grip strength can indicate faster aging. It can also be a warning sign for having a higher risk of chronic diseases, even a shorter life expectancy. He explains grip strength can tell you so much because it's a good marker of a person's overall body strength and ability to fight off infection. Dr. Hajmi says grip strength can start declining around age 50 and people should start exercises before then to make maintain it. He recommends squeezing a racquetball or squash ball for at least 10 minutes twice a day and stresses people must remember to exercise their entire body as well, but don't overdo it. Any sort of weight bearing exercises, you've got to be careful not to tax your spine, not to tax your knees with any of these things. Um, and also not to think that you have to do two hours of this every day. You don't need to do it two hours every day. You know, the research tells us quite literally 10 minutes every day, the everyday part of it, you know, is the most important thing, which outweighs everything else. Dr. Hashmi also says it is important that you follow a healthy diet and get enough sleep in order to maintain good health as you age.